Dr. Sally here, and I'm going to show you why it's much, much, much better to run the zone option from the heavy formation as compared to the spread formation. So heavy is when you bring the tackle over, you put the receiver out. Um, Why do you put the receiver as the backside tackle? Why is this better? Because you have to create surface to run the zone option. So here you got the heavy tackle blocking down. You've got the tackle blocking down. You got the wedge set on the action key with the double scoop on the back side. The receiver and the A back will switch it on the perimeter if the safety's on the play side. The B back checks the levels and then he'll end up walling off the mic when the mic runs over the top. Quarterback will take the snap. He'll run tight off the heavy tackles, block, turn up, and score. And if number two can tackle him, he'll stop his feet, flick the ball to the A back coming around. But the key is you have surface. Now, when you're running out of spread, it's much harder to run because you don't have surface. So now there is no third guy in the surface. So you've got the receiver split out wide, you're under center because it's spread formation. So you got the receiver blocking the deep defender. You got the A back loading with the B back. So these two will have those two. But here's the problem, coaches. This is the problem. You have to cross block it. If you get a B-gap defender, a two technique, a three technique, you got to cross block it. Even with a four-eye, tackle's going to block down. That part's not hard. This is the hard part. The guard now has to get around on number one. So now he's got to get around on number one. He's going to try to get his left knee through his cross, left hand to the stomach, four inch northbound steps. As we all know in high school, that's very, very tough because if this guy comes up the field, which the whole reason why you're running zone option is because number one is taking the quarterback. The guard has got to get leverage on that player. And that's where the zone option breaks down out of the spread formation right there is where the zone option breaks down is because the guard has to get leverage on number one. He's got to get outside leverage on him. Very, very hard thing to do. And thus that's the breakdown of the quarterback. He'll, he'll run tight off that block, and then he's, he's got to go off that block and turn up and score. If two takes him, he's got to stop his feet, flick the ball. So my goal with this video is for you to understand the importance of surface when you run zone option. Having a third guy on the surface makes all the difference. Running it out of the heavy formation makes those zone option go a lot better. And a lot of times you get a numbers advantage because they slide the safety instead of bring a full man over. And that's how you get them.